In this example, we will work out a problem involving a tree diagram. The problem states the following. That there is a new type of smartphone available for sale at a local store. It comes in two types, regular and large. There is a 78% chance that customers will purchase the regular type and a 22% chance that customers will purchase the large type. Also, there's a 10% chance that customers will return the regular type and a 14% chance that customers will return the large type. Compute the probability that if a customer is selected at random, they will not return. In other words, keep the phone they purchased. So we first have to divide the phone into the two types. So we draw a tree diagram. We have the first two branches that splits into the regular type and we assign the probability of 0.78 and the large type assign the probability of 0.22. Now focusing on the regular type, either the person returns it or keeps it, does not return. So there's a 10% chance that they will return the regular phone. That means if you take 100 minus 10, you're left with a 90% chance or 0.9 that they will not return it or keep it. Now for the large phone, 22% purchased the large phone, there's a 14% chance that a customer will return it. 100 minus 14% is 86% or 0.86. If we convert it to a decimal, that's the chance of not returning it. So now let's answer the question. We want to know what's the chance that a customer will not return, keep their phone. So we have to follow all the pathways that lead to a customer keeping the phone. So the first pathway involves the regular phone. 78% of the customers buy the regular phone, 90% of them keep that phone. So following this pathway from beginning to ending, we multiply the adjacent probabilities. That's 0 0.702. Now for pathway two, that's the scenario where a person buys the larger phone, there's a 22% chance and then an 86% chance that they keep it. So 0 0.22 times 0 0.86, 0 0.1892. We add the two probabilities together to get the answer, which is 0.8912. Thanks for watching the video.